We're Cramden Institute. We were started back in 2003 by Mark and Ned Dibner, a father and son. His son was in middle school and they needed to refurbish a computer and decided to give it to one of Ned's schoolmates who didn't have a computer of their own at home. We've taken any computer used from any source, individuals or organizations, companies, and they go through a four-step process where they get triaged, put the parts back in, they get cleaned, they have an operating system installed on them called Ubermix, which is an open source operating system. They get final tests inspected, and then they go off into the hands of students in grades 3 to 12 who do not own a computer at home. So we have a team of staff here that does a lot of the administrative work, but the real hands-on work is done exclusively by volunteers. And really, you need no technical skills whatsoever. We'll teach you everything on how to refurbish a computer from start to finish. So what we're doing is we're going through all these old computers. We're making sure all the hardware is functioning. We're cleaning them out inside and out. It's really satisfying to know that the systems that we're working on are going towards kids that don't have computers and um, it's going to really help them out and maybe open some doors and, and make them excited about technology and uh, maybe get into a future involved with computers. So the award process starts when a student is nominated by their teacher or guidance counselor or someone who knows from the classroom capacity at a school to receive a computer. And these are all students in grades 3 through 12 who don't have access to a working home computer. Once we receive the nomination here at Crampton, we gather them up and we'll either award them in-house to students or we'll go to the schools for the students when the schools have 30 to 80 students. We have a few companies who give us as many as a truck full of computers to pallets of computers. We get them from cities and counties and count and municipalities around the triangle. So we will take absolutely anything that we can. 